Hi, this is Charting Man Dan of TheChartGuys.com, home of technical analysis education. Click the link for a free week trial, no credit card required, and gain access to our multiple live broadcasts daily, community chat room, educational videos, nightly watch lists, and more. Invest in your education and future and join the community today. Looking at Twitter on the daily and weekly time frame, and I'm liking the action in Twitter because not either, not either from a bulls and bears standpoint, but the fact that it can go either direction and the break will be clear. So $14 clear support, $13.90 below it, and clear 10-day moving average resistance of $14.33. So we now have some lower highs being set, tightening range on decreasing volume. If the 10-day moving average becomes support and we head up towards our first resistance level of 1486, we will likely see a bullish MACD cross and that will be our bullish entry signal. If we close below $14, that can be our bearish entry signal or we can wait for a break of 1390 for a bearish entry signal for all-time lows. So Twitter is coming to a very critical juncture as these tightened, these levels tighten and this is a pattern that I'm seeing very common across many tickers. We saw it with Apple last week. We got a bearish break in that scenario. I'm watching this setup in FIT, F-E-Y-E, and AA as well. A little bit different, a little bit less defined. I'm liking Twitter so much because it's right at the all-time low level. And if it is a bearish break, that's going to be some nice downside gains. So not sure which direction it will come in, but when it does happen, it will be clear and it will be accompanied by a volume spike with Apple. When that broke last week, volume was a very clear early indication of which direction the break was coming in. The weekly chart for Twitter shows that double bottom, lower highs still in place, tightening range. And if we can see that bullish break, we're looking at 1486, 1498, and then up into the 15. So there's nice upside potential as well with a lack of moving average resistance, the middle Bollinger Band is catching up after the 10-day. That will be in the low $15 area. So nice gains in either direction, depending on which break we get, and we will be all over it when that does happen. So certainly keep your eye on Twitter and check back to Apple's price action last week for a similar scenario. In fact, let's do it real quick. We had the gap down, lower highs, clear established double bottom of support. Here is Apple, gap down, lower highs, clear established support at $92, $91.84 to be exact, bearish break on high volume, double the bearish volume the day before, and very nice 2% move to the downside on that day. So we'll see what kind of break we get in Twitter. I appreciate you watching. We'll check back in after it occurs. Have a great night. Thanks for watching. The Chart Guys community has compiled trader tips from dozens of traders over the last year and put together a free ebook you can access by clicking the button and entering your email. Have a wonderful night.